So after a photo shoot, when you're looking back at your pictures, you may find yourself thinking, hey, I wish my dress was darker. Or I wish something in the photo was brighter or more saturated. Using something like the HSL sliders, the hue saturation luminance sliders, you can make adjustments to all the colors in your photo if you're not happy with them. So we're gonna go to edit and then color. And down here, you'll see a tab that says HSL. This stands for hue, saturation, and luminance. So each one is gonna control something different. If I select this drop down menu, you'll see which one is which. You can choose hue, saturation, or luminance. So what I wanna start with, because in this photo in particular, we have a lot of different colors. We have the green in the back. We have her yellow top. I actually wanna change up the color of her top. So we're on hue here, and we wanna select the color that we're trying to target, which is yellow. As you can see, when I'm adjusting the slider, it's changing the color of her top. And in adjusting all the other sliders, you'll notice that it changes other parts of the photo. But just know if you're using a slider and it's not doing anything, it's probably because that color is not prevalent in your photo. So for this one, you see I have a lot of turquoise green in the back. So I'm gonna select green too, and I'm able to kind of switch up the color. It's very subtle, but I can definitely see it. So we're going from more green to now I'm changing it to blue. And then what you can do is go from hue to saturation to bring that color out even more. So again, we were working with a little bit of yellow and green. So I'm gonna pop out the yellows and then the greens as well. Let's see if blue works too. Oh, the blue is actually deepening this graffiti in the back, which is really cool. So I actually like that. I'm gonna keep that as is. And also, Cyan as well is making a huge difference. It's saturating the background a lot more. So let's do that. And let's say you wanna make even more adjustments. You can go back to hue and simply adjust accordingly. Not that you've seen it more saturated. So that's what I like to do. I like to saturate it a little bit and then make the adjustment so I can see how the final look will be. Like this cyan right here, I'm gonna pop out the cyan a little bit more in the hue section. I'm also gonna adjust her skin tone by decreasing the orange in the saturation tab here. That's what I like to do just to make sure that the skin tone, she's not looking like too orange, you know? So I'll show you when I toggle this back and forth, what difference that made to all the colors in the photo. So this shade of yellow, I'm not loving after blending up the saturation. I find that it's a little bit too much, especially with the background. So I'm actually gonna decrease the saturation and make it into more of a silver tone, which I think complements the photo a little bit more. So now that we've taken care of the yellow, it's now silver. I'm gonna toggle this back and forth and you can see what a difference that made to all the colors in the picture.